Greetings! I am Cross Knights, and are you ready to see my favorite demo from the Steam Next Fest? I mean, I only played five, but this is my favorite one. Legendary Hopalite. So, it's like a tower defense game, but like more in the vein of like Plants vs. Zombies and something like D D D Bloon Defense or, or uh, Kingdom Rush. You'll see. But you, you gain a more active role, similar to like Epic War. I really like it. I'm definitely getting it when it comes out. It, it wouldn't even have to change too much <laughs> from what it is already. Help! Help! Help us, please! The skeletons have already killed so many villagers! Captain, a stranger is approaching, with a weapon in hand. Blow the horn. Prepare for battle. So, as you, uh... Well, I'm trying to play with a controller. That's not how this works. Um... <laughs> So yeah, here are the controls. You, you just go left, right, like you can't go forward, but you press S to attack. So starting out, you are the first guy, but this is just to, you know, get the basic controls down. So there we go, the gate HP drop. This is very standard for this type of game. If the guys get past, you lose HP. If you lose all of your HP, you lose the level. Now, they can't actually attack you. If they attack you, you lose stamina, which is over here. Um, and then you're basically stunned for a bit. More enemies are closing in. We need more men. Phalanxes. To arms! Captain, we're ready! Alright, so now I can hit one to summon dudes. So now they'll go and defend for me. And as I kill people, I get basically points to summon more guys. And that, that's over here. <laughs> that's on that little line right there. So you notice they're defending for me? Now, they do have health bars. They can die, and then you have to resummon. But they can take on these skeletons. Alright, Skeleton Swordsman 2. They're tougher due to their helmets. I don't know why I'm attacking the guys, that, the lanes that are already defended. They should attack undefended lanes. But we, we've all seen, we've all seen, like, Flash, I mean, if you're on this channel for any length of time, you, you've seen Flash games that are similar to this. But look at the polish, look at the graphics. <laughs> and it feels good. And yes, it does get more complicated as you go on. Almost. Two arms! We're definitely doing this row. <laughs> this row is getting a ton of skeletons. Oh god, they're gonna break through. Oh, well, it looks like they're saying it. Captain, they'll break through the gates at this rate. We should ring the bell and call for reinforcements from the other camps. Only prayers to the gods can help us through this tribulation. Oh, Supreme Zeus, we beseech you to save us. Hmm. Why do you go out there? No gods will save us now. I stand corrected. Young Captain, you do not believe in gods, do you? Who are you? I am Gaia, the mother of all things. Zeus, the god you prayed to, is only one of my descendants. By the grace of Gaia! Can you tell us more about these things that are invading us? These are skeleton soldiers from the underworld, the land of Hades. They attacked Ithaca for a purpose. It's not just an invasion. The attacks will continue and become more and more dangerous each time. It will spread throughout the whole of Ithaca. These are just scouting soldiers. Why are you helping us? Oh. I love every living thing on this earth all equally. I do not get involved in any matter if it is following the laws of nature. But these skeletons do not belong in this world. They break the laws. So you can help us get through this tribulation? Oh. These beings are from the underworld, Hades citizens, so I will not interfere but I can bestow upon you enchanted weapons to fight this calamity. There are many more waves of monsters coming for Ithaca soon. I have never wielded an enchanted weapon before, so I don't know what it even is. Then I shall teach you. Now, take this spear as a gift from the earth. Hmm. My goddess, I thank you for everything. He really took uh, meeting a god for the first time really well. All right, that's just the tutorial wave. All right, we've opened up the ability to see stats and equip equipment. So this is the new spear. It actually does less damage. 
And honestly, when I was playing this, I mainly looked at the skill. <laughs> this has the skill of a fan of javelins. And I will be able to activate that now. The, the default equipment doesn't even have skills. It does, they just want to let me use it. Okay, fair. Uh, then there's also stats, but I don't have a stat point yet, so... We're just gonna go to the next battle. We better hurry up and prepare for the next enemy assault. Super prepared. Already got this. Alright. So, same deal as before. But now I can cast a spell. Boom! Five spears! <laughs> decent spell. It's like the first one you get. It's pretty decent. Uh, so, let's protect there. These are all upgraded guys. Ugh! Most of those spirits missed. And we got a skeleton soldier number three. Uh, increased chance to block when HP is low. Yeah, so they can just stop my attacks dead. Uh, yeah! Did he block and die? Interesting. I guess the blocks still take, uh, they still take damage. And yeah, the controls are pretty good. Because, you know, you got, like, your, your Q, W, E, and R for the skills. Then you got the number key to summon the troops. That's good. There's the stamina. Um, if you run out of stamina, you are, uh, stunned for a bit. But if you stop moving, your stamina will increase. And your regular attack, the, the regen almost goes as fast as your regular attack, so that's not an issue. It's just when you start using a whole bunch of skills, that's when you're going to run out of stamina. Also, if you take damage, like a guy gets too close to you, you will also take some stamina damage, so... Something to manage. And if you get, if these guys get close, you can actually stab them with your sword, because you have two weapons. You have your spear and your sword. In fact, I'm actually going to let these guys get a little bit close, just to show you. There. And your sword, I believe, does more damage than the spear, so... Also something to think about. Alright, we're summoning the boys. Let's uh, throw some spears here. Oh yeah, I can call a wave early, and then I get a bunch of points in order to summon uh, more guys. That was actually a little bit of a dangerous summon there, but whatever, I think I can handle it. Uh, the wolves have less HP than a lot of the things, but they they can dodge your attacks, so... Sometimes they effectively are a lot harder to kill. But only sometimes. You also can't get rid of troops um, to summon new ones. That You have to die. They have to die in order to, like, take place. So that doesn't really matter with these guys, but... Because you can just summon other guys behind them. It, it'll matter... It'll matter later. I guess what I'm saying is probably confusing until you actually see what I'm talking about, but... Sometimes you have to be careful who you summon. Just not yet. You have no place here! Yeah! That was a good one. Got three hits. You have no place here! And that attack is, of course, more effective the closer they are. This little... Yeah, <laughs> I figured uh, most of those were gonna hit someone. Real nice cooldown on this I attack, too. Ready. Uh, that one <laughs> only hit one of them. Uh, they're breaking through. Get down! All right, get out of here. So we got a skill point and some coins and some weapons. So we're gonna equip all of those. Yep. So these are the stats. I, I like to focus on strength. And you can, if you don't like the way you spec your your uh, stats, you can just reset them at any time for free. New troop. So these guys will throw barrels to stun people. It's pretty close range, however. Now, these guys can be leveled up just like your other guys with gold coins. I need 80 to level this guy up. I need 100 to level these guys up. And I can, I can choose a path. I can go up or down. But uh, I actually can't do anything right now because I'm poor. I don't have any money. But the equipment, let's see here. We got a new sword. Less physical damage from the sword, but it has a fan of daggers. I don't know. Let's try it. And what is this? Twin Spears and Frenzy. Huh. I kind of like that. 
I mean, less physical damage, though. Yeah, let's get this instead. Let's get Twin Spears. Alright, next! Hmm. Captain, I just received a report from our southern outpost that it has been attacked by skeleton soldiers, and our troops were at the disadvantage. That area is quite densely populated with citizens. Well, tribulation has begun and spread to all of Ithaca. Goddess Gaia was right. The situation here is stable for the time being. You will hold the gate in my stead until there is an order from the head... No idea what that word is. We shall now report and bring news to the Goddess Gaia and help the southern outpost. Yes, sir. Have faith in me. I do. That's why I gave you the job. If I didn't have faith in you, I would have not uh, entrusted the entire city. All right, let's... <laughs> I'm just saying you sound a little bit insecure. Don't worry. I, I believe in you. Help me, friend. Cool. We're starting with troops. Twin Spear! A lot of guys here. Holy crap. Barrels! <laughs> Captain Dio, we are here to help. Is that Dio or Dio? I want to say Dio because it's more funny. Bam! <laughs> right, calling next wave. Spearman. Alright. Spearman 3. We're getting some... Oh, I got like full summon here. Yeah, I'm maxed at uh, 400 until I uh, until I level up my leadership skill. No, no, I threw two spears at the one guy who's gonna die in one spear, but <laughs> you know. All right, new skills are unlocked. These are based on my um, my abilities. What was that? Fan of daggers. Pretty useless skill. Most. Oh, this is a good skill. One of my favorite, actually. Sealed throw. Uh, the, the final boss in this demo, by the way, is very hard, and it took me multiple times to beat. So I had to, like, use the best skills, and, like, that was one that I kept. It's a really good skill. Just randomly goes around and murders people. Got the wolf. You gotta make sure it hits someone, though. You can throw it down a lane, and if there's no one there, it'll just not <laughs> do anything. Let's burn down there. There we go. But yeah, Fan of Daggers, that's for close range. It does a lot of damage if someone's close range, but I feel like, especially like for most of the stage into the demo, that's just not going to happen. If people are getting that close, you've, 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 you've done it badly. <laughs> Things are in, a, in dire straits anyway. So that's probably not going to save you at this point. You're already doomed in most cases. Yeah. Oh, they both hit him even though... Hmm. I thought they'd keep going, but alas. And yeah, those are archers, so they can they can deal damage to my troops. Which isn't that desirable. Like, damage before they get even close to them. Shore that row up. And I'm running pretty low on stamina here, but that's fine. Barrel! Yeah, it's like 70 damage. So that's like two of my spear attacks and they're stunned. And it's an area. And it leaves like oil on the ground. I don't know if there's a way to capitalize on that. There probably is, but... New skill unlocked. I think that's haste? Yeah, look, I'm, I'm attacking faster. Cool. That should do it. Oh, there's only one wave left. <laughs> probably don't need all that, but hey, why not? All right, let's call the last wave. <laughs> Just hit him twice. Cyclops deals AOE, devours allies to recover HP. Guy's no joke, in other words. And let me just show you. Um, I've run out of HP, now I'm stunned. And you're stunned for a while, so you generally don't want that to happen. <laughs> But upon being unstunned, you'll gain a massive amount of stamina back, and then you can start doing things again. Alright. Fan of daggers! I don't even know if that hit. Alright, well, he's dead. <laughs> Let's just see if we can save these guys' lives. Uh. Oh no, my friends died. Oh well. I got more friends. <laughs> it's war after all.
Makes me think I shouldn't have summoned them, though. The enemy is attacking with increased numbers and strength, Captain. I think you should upgrade the army before going to the next battle. Yes, please guide me. New troop. Walls. <laughs> we've, we've hired the carpenters. So select which troop you want to upgrade. I'm going to upgrade the uh, basic guys. And so... No, these, these guys. Uh, I think I want them to have more attack, but more defense probably makes more sense. Yeah, let's go the... I, I went this way the first time. Let's go this way. So now they can defend themselves better. You shield the... Okay, this is totally the better route. Because it's not like they do a ton of damage even when they up, you upgrade them, but now they can push enemies back. Like, that's highly useful. Let's get increased agility. And see what we got here. Empower. Increase critical damage. And block break for 12 seconds. And restoration. Restoration's really great. I don't think I need it yet. But that essentially gives you infinite stamina when you have that. Now, let's keep Twin Spears. And yeah, I, I mean, the stats are nice. But I really like the ability. Wild Thrust. This is another one that's pretty short range, but I'll get it just to show it. Explosive Shield. This is another close range one. So I'm just gonna keep... Ooh, but look at... Yeah, whatever. We're fine. Next mission. The Night Siege. So now I can build walls. And that thing that I was talking about... Um, where it matters, like, where you put things and when you put things is is now. Because I can't destroy those walls. Um, so if one of them's, like, slightly damaged, and I'm like, I should, I should like, replace no it. Too bad. <laughs> you have to wait. I could be wrong. There might be a way to do it, but I don't think so. There's no way that I could tell how to do it. Um, and also, these guys will move ahead of the building area if there's no wall, but if there is a wall, they'll stay behind it, and they can attack over the wall. So, there's basically no way that I can, um, that I can protect those guys there. They're on their own. Because <laughs> they went above the wall because of the order. Oh, that, yeah, that's the stabbing. Another ability that's probably not going to come into play most of the time. Unless things have gone horribly wrong. Oh, can I not? Oh, it's three. But yeah, now I'm building a wall behind those guys. Now they can't even retreat if they want to. It's horrifying. No place here. Summoning next wave. Let me get some help here. Barrels of fun. Get you out of here. Cool. <laughs> Speared him. Skeleton Phalanx. High block chance. Splits into... No place here. Uh, three spearmen when shields breaks. Yeah, rough. Wrong button. Okay, well, <laughs> they're still fine. Alright. There we go, got two of the spearmen. Alright, next hard wave. I like it when they warn you if a wave is going to be harder. That That is nice. It's a nice courtesy. Alright, that's all nicely defended. Cool. Don't think we're gonna have a problem here. That wave wasn't hard at all. What were you guys talking about? Hell, we're gonna summon right now because I'm crazy. Wolves are coming. Also, because it didn't say the wave was gonna be hard, I would not have summoned if it said it was hard. Barrels. Die. Awesome. <laughs> Alright. Let's summon. Come on, come on. Ha! Yeah, those guys, these guys can take some damage. Let's get a barrel up in here. I mean, those guys in front of that wall, surprise they're still alive. <laughs> True champions, them. Hey, you guys don't even get to get on the screen. And 
Next wave is hard, so we'll wait a little bit. That's enough. Let's go! Last wave! I was expecting a Cyclops, to be honest. Oh, there he is. A rock thrower Cyclops. Okay, yeah. Well, I don't think those guys over there are going to be fine after this. <laughs> the fate of true heroes, unfortunately, is sometimes to die horribly. I say I am not ready. Oh god. Not now. Come on, we can save them. Oh, they've died. <laughs> no. Oh well. He's still alive. Good god. All right, there we go. Yeah, there was no saving those guys was there. And I'm a, yeah, I just ran out of stamina. So as the walls break, those guys move forward, so I can't just put another wall in front of them. <laughs> so another thing to consider. All right, not too bad. And I got two skill points. And a boatload of equipment. So now we have archers, the utility of which should be obviously apparent. Now what was I even using here? Go, go away, new troop. I get it. I, I'm looking at other things. Oh, so that thing I was using was in power. Okay, eh, I don't care about that that much. Uh, I'd rather have haste. Just seemed like it wasn't doing anything. You can also see my stats over here. Um, again, I really like strength. I think we should put some in leadership. So you can see what that does there. But that's basically for summoning, guys. Now, they haven't told me that I can sell things yet, but you can you can sell things. So I don't need this. But the, the money's for upgrading your troops, so it's good. This This will give me more spear damage. Hmm... This is the one thing, like, I, I care about the stats on the spear, for sure. Decisive throw. Enhance every next spear, increasing... Huh. It's auto-cast. All right, let's try that. Decapitate? I should... I just want to see what that is. It's probably close range. It sounds close range, but I want to see it. This one's okay if I... I mean, I, I'm, I'm reluctant to get rid of my shield throw because it's such a good move, but... All right, now we'll go to the troops. Let's see what we can do. Um, I can't, I could almost upgrade them immediately. That's too bad. You can only bring four guys at once, by the way, but I only have four guys currently, so that's not a big deal. But these, oh, this is a immediate upgrade. Look at that. The only issue with upgrading your troops is that it will cost more, uh, I don't know, valor. I don't, I don't know what the, the currency it is to summon troops is called, but it'll cost more to summon them, so. Uh, you want your leadership up if you have a bunch of upgraded guys. Alright, there's my archers. <laughs> they exist in towers. Now, they don't do a ton of damage, but they do do some damage. Alright, make archer. And I believe if I summon Hopolites uh, behind them, or the, the phalanx or whatever they're called, uh, yeah, they, they go right past the archers, so the order doesn't matter on that. They will always go to the front, the archers will always be in the back. You have no place here. Which is pretty nice. Ah, so that's my shield ability now. And that's decapitate. Okay, yeah, that is a super ultra close range move, but it will do a ton of damage, so... Cool. Huh. What is this? Decisive throw. Enhances every spear. Hmm. Does it cost more stamina or something to do it? I think so. I th So it's automatically on, but I'm like burning stamina. That makes sense. And so the shield throw is okay. <laughs> but it's just closer range, so it's not as useful. Um. Cool. Got my archers up. I kind of want to see how much damage they're doing. It's just saying block, it's not telling me the number. But I know that they still take damage when you block, so... Hard wave coming. Get down. That's the wrong lane! Oh well. Uh... Haste! Yeah, buddy! Okay. Help me, friend! 
Okay. Wait, that should have worked. There we go. Oh, do they cost more? No. Yeah, they cost one or uh, ten. One hundred ten. Damn. Get down. There we go. Yeah, haste is haste is better than that critical chance thing. You have no place here. Bam. Okay, that that's actually pretty good. That in some yeah. ways might be better than the shield throw. But the shield throw is fun. It bounces around like a ping pong ball. Oh my. Speed up! I would like to decapitate someone you once. No At least once. We might have to do I might have to let someone through. <laughs> Space. Yeah, not a lot of active abilities that I can do most of the time here. Except for that. Because one of my my spear thing is passive. And then decapitate's just not gonna come into play. <laughs> Unless things get really bad. I can summon already? That would be useless though. There's no one. You have no place here. Well, let's build walls. Okay, I can't build all the walls. Ah, I can summon next, it'll be fine. It's not a hard wave. Death Cavalry enrages skeleton allies. Okay. That sounds dangerous. Oh yeah, it looks dangerous. <laughs> Just got a blazing Spartan helmet. You yeah, get out of here. You and your horse can vamoose. V vamoose? That, that, that's definitely not the word. Eh. Oh, there's another archer there. I can't put a wall down. Fair. No place here. Get down. Oh god. I don't want the archers enraged. Yeah, they're they're, they're going crazy. Gotcha. Now we can replace these guys. Wait, they're not. See, he's not going to go in front of the wall though. Yeah. So should I have put a wall there? Maybe not. These are the type of things you're going to need to think about. Unless there is a way to get rid of these, but as far as I can tell, there's not. They never tell you that there is. I'm gonna be crazy. I'm summoning the next wave immediately. That's how confident I am. Get down. Is that a mistake? Maybe. I don't know. <laughs> Got all the wolves. Summoning. All right, ghosts. Ghosts are uh, highly resistant to physical attack. Now, the first time I did this. I actually had a toggle ability that was a flame spear, and it was just it, it just one shot at all the ghosts. <laughs> but it looks like even without that, these guys aren't a huge threat. Let's see how a barrel does against them. Looks like it killed them like instantly. So yeah, these guys aren't too bad. <laughs> I can see how they'd be bad if they're like mixed in with the other skeletons and you don't have the means to deal with them. But I don't know if that. Oh, are they just moving through my guys? Okay, now I really see why they're bad. <laughs> Fair. Understood, game. Yeah, here we go. I'm about to run out of stamina, but that's okay. We can just let that happen. Alright, recharging stamina. Uh, there we go. And we're good. Ah, ghosty! Oh, I should have decapitated him. All right, I'm gonna try to decapitate that ghost in front there. That is the plan. Ghost decapitation is on the menu. Yeah! <laughs> I don't know how much damage it did. It looked like it just killed him, because I think there's a chance that it executes them. Sometimes you gotta decapitate a ghost. And their stupid ghost neck. Oh my. Certainly wish I had sealed throw now. Oh my. Oh dear. Go! 
Barrels, barrels, barrels. A little bit closer. A little bit closer. Decapitate! <laughs> I'm running out of stamina. Ah, alright. I, I think we're good. <laughs> but what a wave! There we are. Archers are fighting back. Saved him. Okay. I don't think there's, you know... There's no mechanical reason to save them, but, like, mentally in my heart, you want to save your boys, right? Alright, final troop. Well, for this demo, anyway. So I'm gonna have to let someone go. I think it's gonna be the archers? Cool. I would love to level this up. That would be great. But we'll see. We'll see if I can... If I, if I got enough equipment, I can sell it to get enough. Yeah, now they're telling me that I can sell, so that's cool. There we go. Convert all spear damage into fire damage. That's, that's not bad. Wait, what was the stats, though? E... No, I can't. That, that's way too weak, though. Yeah, the stats are bad. This is one of the best abilities that is in the demo, though. Uh, so we're gonna, we're gonna equip that. I don't know if I've tried that one before. Let's try the battle cry. Decapitate's actually not bad, I gotta say. Oh, but this one's, this one's probably better. And I guess we'll keep the shield. So if I sell, like, everything else... Yep, that was enough. Let's level this up. Now, the catapults take up a lot of space. <laughs> but they're, they're a good unit. They will actually do damage, whereas, like, the arrows, not as much. Our scouts reported that the enemy general has entered battle. Perhaps this is a covert assault to capture our barracks. Beware, Captain Dio. This could be the biggest fight yet. Yes, yeah, strategist, I will protect this. Okay, this is the battle that I, it took me, like, so many times to beat. And I will probably also... The demo has two levels after this. I think I'm going to end it after this battle. Hopefully, I release this in time for you to see... to play the demo, because sometimes the demos disappear after the Steam Next Best. But, yeah, let me make sure I have, like, the best of everything. No screwing around. So I want shield throw. I I don't I don't want the other one. Like th this one is this this is better. This is decent. This is really good. And I I think I need this restoration. I'll, it'll give me essentially infinite stamina. And let's just do attack damage and attack damage. Do I really not want to do any endurance? Yeah. Let, let's just do attack damage. <laughs> let's hope this works out. Now, the way I beat this the first time is that I just died so many times that I eventually got enough upgrades that I was able to punch through it, but we'll see. Um, if I die, I'll just have to play the entire thing again, and then I'll show the final wave again. Because it's the final wave that's an issue. You're fine until then. Alright, so. This... Don't think I need to explain why that's a good ability. <laughs> it usually clears a lane. In almost every situation, just boom. Then we got that again. And this is actually a sword ability that's not close range, so that's why you want that. And then my final ability, my, my stamina just restored. It essentially gives you infinite stamina. Quite, quite good, obviously. All right, let's put our first catapult. Now, I believe... Yeah, I can have a catapult and a guy, and then I can put a wall behind the guy. That's probably the best configuration. Uh, let's clear this. Cool. Yep, summon next guys. Screw it. Got them. Oh, um, catapult. Catapult. Protect the catapults while they're being built. Running low on stamina. Stamina's restored. Like, ridiculous ability. <laughs> it's like it gets rid of one of the mechanics. Did I? I put that catapult in the wrong place. Now I can't put a wall in front of it. That's terrible. Oh well, nothing I can do about it now. I panicked, you see. Well, hopefully that doesn't come to bite me. Let's 
do a little spear magic there. Next wave is hard, let's call it. So I can get enough to get another catapult that I'll put in the correct place this time. Not now. Not now. But what, what about now? Yeah, that is so good. Like, that ability is, like, ludicrously good. Stamina recover. Alright, let's do, uh, let's get these guys out. I'll wait on the next catapults a little bit. Alright. Yeah, that catapult just did 80 points of damage, like, solid. We might be okay. This is a better configuration than I had last time. Alright. But I don't know. The, the boss is ridiculous. He's very powerful. It's possible no matter what I set up is going to completely prepare me. Come on. Don't be shy. Walk into my spears. That's not what I meant to do. I did a stamina recover when I had full. Whatever. Pop. Got enough for another cannibal. Ca can cannibal. <laughs> they just start eating my own guys. Okay. This. Can I... That hit no one. <laughs> I was like, I can hit both waves, right? No. I think it's probably a maximum of two waves. You put it, like, on the side of the wave. Or the lane I'm in. But... AoE wasn't quite as good as I thought it was. That was nice. That went exactly where I wanted it to go. Alright, one more catapult. Then we set up the phalanxes. Then we set up the walls. And then I'll be prepared. There's 12 waves in this. We're on wave 5 right now. I just need to be prepared before the boss comes. But I got good abilities... Um, there we go. Final catapult. I, like, can't hit four without looking sometimes, so that's why I'm clicking instead of just hitting four. I can't hit any of the numbers without looking, so I don't know. I panic. It's not natural to me. I don't play a lot of keyboard games. I'm still, like, at heart. Started as a console gamer, so... Uh, here... Cool. Alright, we're getting there. Alright, an Axeman. There we go. Got some guys there. Cool. I think... Alright, we're halfway through. <laughs> gotcha. Down the line. Alright, it's time for walls next. Next wave! Alright, first walls, going up. Except for there, because I screwed up. <laughs> oh well. That was nice. <laughs> and this is nice. Yeah. Wall. Alright. <laughs> and I skipped a little bit just because I'd rather this video not be an hour, but, you know. We'll see. Alright, this could be an issue. No lies, could be a problem. Good, stunned him. Come on, I need to take that guy out. Awesome. Alright, that wasn't too bad. I'm gonna lose the Hapalides, though, and I cannot replace them. So that sucks. But, you know. I mean, I can replace them, but they'll take up a spot now. They're not gonna walk in front of the walls. Oh, well. <laughs> like, let's see. Can I... Hmm. No, I think he's gonna stop at the wall, right? Like, yeah. Alright, that's not bad, actually. If he's right there. Cool. 
Yeah, I remember these guys have a ton of HP, and I don't think I can hit them with a... Yeah, if I had an upgraded barrel, I think I could hit them, but... Uh, and there goes my shield off into the ether. All right, Red Spearman. Whatever, you're not getting over here. <laughs> Alright, just more guys. More guys! We want to build up our forces as much as possible until the boss gets here. Even if the... I, I really wish I hadn't put that catapult there. <laughs> I'm super regretting that. Gonna call the wave, this might be a mistake, but... I think I can take care of this guy. Cool. Okay, I, I'm maxed. I'm maxed as far as uh, troop summon, so let me see. Let's put some barrels here. I mean, what happens if I just summon all these guys? What? <laughs> there we go. <laughs> They'll just create an army as people get past. That might not be bad. And it'll protect my uh, my um, catapults a little bit. Yeah, I don't know, I just put guys on, it's fine. <laughs> Take this! Yeah, the <laughs> stamina restore is pretty key for this part. I'm not gonna summon the wave early because I really just don't need the troop summon points. That's the only thing that summoning early does. Okay, cool. Now I'll summon early because we're done. One more wave until the boss. Damn it, screwed that up. <laughs> you definitely don't want to call early now, the boss will come. Want to make sure everything is cleared here. Alright, is there anything else I can summon that makes sense? I mean, I'll just, I'll just summon to the max here, it's fine. <laughs> if there's a space, I will summon. All right, here we go. There's the boss. What irony. I went through life and death with your father in the Trojan War, and now I have to fight his son. Perhaps you're mistaken. My father was a herder and has never been to war to this day. I am not wrong. You are the spitting image of your father. In appearance, mannerisms, and voice. My father and I have no such thing in common, as you said. Ah, perhaps I've said too much. Let my sword do the talking instead. You move aside or die. I have chosen death ever since I put on this armor. All right, here we go. This is not a dress rehearsal. I have to kill that boss. Now, guys, I'm pretty sure I'll just keep on coming, like, essentially infinitely. So, you gotta just attack the boss if you can. Hopefully you have the defenses to, like, take care of things. But you just saw that area of effect attack. So, like, <laughs> I I'm not really safe. <laughs> even with all that I've done. And yeah, you again, you don't have a life bar, but you have a stamina bar that counts as your life. If I get hit by his attacks, I have a chance of being stunned. So you definitely don't want that. Um, I'd like to take care of this guy. Now run! Okay. <laughs> Alright, we lost a phalanx there. Let's replace. If I can just keep the catapults up, that'd be great, but... There, cleared that wave. Stamina restore! Alright. this. And note, I keep on going back to attack the boss. That's the most important thing. Um, phalanx, phalanx, phalanx. Alright, used up all my powers there. Man, I should have used that spear on that wave over there, but very boss focused. Got him. Oh my god, that was so much e I, I just didn't have a good setup the first time I played this. <laughs> Your father would have been very proud of you. And so am I. 
<laughs> so strange. Even in death, he's still talking about my father. There would be no red flowers growing this time. What does that mean? I don't know what that means. Um, so again, I, I want to end the demo here. I was shocked that there were two more levels. Uh -huh. This is an encyclopedia. So I can see not only the monsters. Damn wolves. <laughs> but also the characters. So we got him. Got him. We got Gaia. And we got, uh, Ow Ajax? Is that a J? What a weird font. Oh, Ajax. All right, it's spelled regularly here. But I don't know, I'm kind of uh, intrigued by the story. Like, he says his father was just a herder, but he's saying that he was a great war hero. That That's an interesting twist. Hopefully the demo either stays up or is up by the time that you see this, so you can try it if you haven't. Because uh, there are two more levels, but I think that's enough. Again, for these demos, I want to be like, you know whether you're interested in the game by now. Like, after an hour of gameplay, you you know if this is your thing. Perfect game for the channel. Almost definite Let's Play when it comes out. I, I want to play it now. I want it out now. I'm actually more excited about this game than a lot of the other games that I've seen so far. So yeah, I am Cross Knights. Thank you very much for watching. And I hope that you liked Legendary Hopolite. And I'll see you guys next time. Later.